तीन है in this day and age everyone has a voice even if they don't even if they don't even if they don't know it I started to stutter at the age of four it started off barely noticeable and quickly became worse and worse until until I was a freshman in high school and entirely fearful of public speaking. Stuttering is a genetic neurological a disorder in which the brain sends the wrong signals to the vocal folds causing them to shut while speaking. The funny thing about stuttering is that I, if I sing or speak or speak or speak or speak or speak with someone or even speak or even speak with a or even speak or even speak with a recording of of myself I am entirely fluent now I want to share with you tonight a bit about how I've tried to break a break through the silence break through the silence that break through the silence that my fear has created uh, 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 the, uh, 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 the, uh, the fear not only of the physical boundary, but also, uh, but also other facets of my life. Possibly because of, possibly because of my own struggle for voice, I have taken a, I have taken, I have taken, I have taken, I have taken a liking to spoken word poetry. So I hope you will bear with me as I attempt my first spoken word. Tired. He's never hurting. Every, Every word, word is sound, sound. No. A, a piece of what was supposed to be talking about. Mom, Mom I'm. I'm <coughs> okay. The stutter, stutter always crept in at the right time. <laughs> you know, I'm with the sign says we should quarantine the gaze. A really great representation of my Arab heritage. But sadly, I'm scared that my Tata and Jitta would agree. Grandpa Bob, though, he's, he's been, been out and proud since the 70s, boasting his own battle-worn facade just so that they recognize that he is here and he will stay here. What am I supposed to do with identities that don't mix? Like oil and water interrupted only by the gasps and spasms of a disability. When does one figure out their place? When do I know that I'm here and gonna stay here? People see but they never see me. They look at my skin and think white, my school and think rich, my body and think male, my ashes and think straight. Or maybe they think, okay, okay. We live in a world of labels and representations of reality. Clothing brands our bodies like animals on a farm. Hi, my name is Gucci or Prada or gay or straight or rich or poor. We are labeled throughout our lives. Forced into tight constricting boxes waiting for the moment to burst out and yell that we're here. But most, but most never will. Maybe, maybe I'm a terrorist, or maybe, or maybe I'm a. F <laughs> <laughs> Packet. 
but a stereotype, an archetype, a broad representation of an individual character, characteristic that can never truly tell you who I am. The first time I came out to someone, I did it over AOL Instant Messenger. The irony of the modern day, requiring an impersonal block of text to express yourself, a silent form of communication to make yourself heard, a virtual reality set me free. But slowly, the sting of silence slipped off. Slowly, the fear subsided. Each whisper, whisper a step closer to fluency. Things, things began to change. change. The, the only, only silence I experience is the one that I control. I can, I can speak when I want, want to. to. You, you will listen. listen. They will listen. Teta and Jiddo will listen. You just have to know that you see yourself. You just have to know that you hear yourself. You just have to know that you can be yourself. And then you will know that your voice is heard. Thank you.